Yo guys, Big Randy here. Welcome back to another episode of Forza Horizon. So, uh, right now we're doing a bucket list challenge and we're just trying to build up points and stuff like that. You know, these are usually pretty easy. Uh, this is an awesome car though, I definitely want to buy it. Um, <laughs> thought I was going to lose my points right there. It's a really nice rally car. Great for off-roading. It's fairly quick too. Probably not a very high top speed though, but this thing seems awesome. <clears throat> so, let's see how many skill points we can get out of this. Just keep on going through this course and trying to grab more and more points. I think we already pretty much won, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see if we can like get like a world record or something. Then I don't know. All right, here we go. Whoa, boom! Got a minute left. Here we go. This is so easy. Luckily, I have traction control off. I noticed it's a lot easier than trend. Oh! Okay, we gotta hurry. We gotta hurry. That's what I hate. Just trees around here. So bad. No. Woo. Ultimate air. There we go. That'll give us a lot of points. Keep on building it. Gosh darn it. I hate the trees so much. Can't really avoid them either. Come on. Give me those points. Woo. Ultimate air. Give me some drifts. All right. We only got 20 seconds left. I think it keeps on going until we end the combo though. So we're all good there. What? How does that make me lose points? Are you serious? Okay, I thought this was going well, but it's not. Let's we'll keep on going and see what we got. 10 seconds left. Come on. We can do it. We can do it. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you haven't already. Turn on the notifications for this channel as well. Oh, come on. All right, we're going to try that again. Here we go. Let's try this again. It's a nice vehicle. I like it. It's a lot of fun to drive. Oh boy. Alright. Once we hit 30,000, I'm just going to quit because I don't want to risk losing more points. So I think we have about 6,000 now. Yeah. 7,000, 8,000. Just going to keep that combo going on. Get those 1,000. We're almost at 30,000 points already. Holy cow. Alright, here we go. About halfway there. Foul. What? Why did I get destruction for that? Why not? Alright, here we go. Don't hit those wind things. Okay, we're good, we're good. They make us lose your points, so that's good. Okay, we're already at 30,000. Let's go ahead and uh, stop the car and just end it here. Here we go. 30,000 points. Yep. Let's do it. Wow, we got like nothing for that. Bunch of fans though, that's good. We need 10 million fans for the final showcase. That's a lot of fans. Right now we're level 91. So I won this Ford GT through a... Uh, a wheel spin, and it's honestly a pretty nice car. I put some very minor upgrades on it. Is that a Celine right there? I bet that's a uh, Celine. Yep, that is. All right. I'm still trying to find the last road. There's just one more road for me to get, and I don't know where it's at. I mean, I've checked this whole, like, every little area, like, ten times, and I don't see any gray. At some point, I just might have to drive around the map and check for gray areas. I mean, even the last two, it took me forever to find that one little bridge that I didn't drive through yet. And I bet it's like one of these things over here, like one of the highways, since I haven't really driven through them that much. It could be like a tiny little tiny like gray area too. Like, And I turned all the icons off too to help, but now at this point I actually should probably play the game. In which, in case, there's a XP thing over there. Which XP though? It doesn't really say. Um, but yeah, we're just going to keep on continuing trying to build those fans. Get that final showcase, hopefully soon. It might. It's going to take a while, though. We have to do a lot of stuff. But we got lots of stuff to do now, so we can keep on continuing that. And we have a race nearby. Let's go ahead and do that. Yep, All right. This one is going to be fun. We got a Buggies Championship now. Uh, I probably want to get a different buggy. I don't really like that one. I feel like the, the smaller ATVs do a better job. Oh, okay. These are all... Ooh, we got A class too. Holy cow. See, these don't go very fast, but I'm sure we can upgrade them. At least you're facing off like the same guys, at least. Hmm. I believe I have this one. It's just upgraded. Which one do I have, actually? Let me check to make sure this one's... Yeah, I didn't put any engine upgrades on it. That's the problem. The top speed's terrible. But the other stats are pretty okay. Let's do it. I've been wanting to do more street races as well. Problem is you don't really get uh, fans from it. So, And these ATVs are, and the buggies are really stylish. Look at those tires. Here we go. 
Wow, launch is terrible. All right, here we go. Those guys are probably majorly upgraded too. I just don't think I upgraded this car. It's really? That's what I hate about the buggies. They just don't want to jump properly. They just kind of like do that. And now I'm going to lose this race. It's still rolling over. Oh my god, this is so bad. Why are the buggies so bad? I hate these things. Alright, we're just gonna try this again. I could not catch up to them. I was like nine seconds behind the whole entire time. That's the thing with this high of a difficulty, there's like no forgiveness whatsoever. So, you mess up, well, you're screwed. Alright, even if it's the little tiniest mess ups, like you gotta race nearly perfect if you're on pro. There we go. There we go. Doing pretty decent now. Plus, I know the track a little bit better, so we're okay. This track is kind of confusing, by the way, believe it or not. Oh boy, don't hit me on the jump. Uh. Why do I keep spinning out? Every okay, here's the, the another thing that annoys me about buggies is that they always spin out when they hit the ground. It's really weird. And this thing doesn't accelerate quick enough. Should have put more acceleration upgrades into it. It's the top of its B class, so it's like 697, I think. You got a couple extra points, but that's about it. Usually I just cut off the acceleration, just kind of turn through here. It's trying to, it's trying to spin on me again. Here we go. Sharp turn right here. What the heck? Stop spinning on me. All right, here we go. And I guess traction control doesn't really help much, but I feel like turning traction control off didn't really do anything. Helps you drift a lot more, that's for sure. Oh boy, all right. Doing that gives me some more time, I noticed that. Our best lap's 50 seconds, that's pretty competitive. Consider these guys are behind now. I wanna at least try to get a podium. Oh boy, we got a collision going on here. Bought us some more time. I bet I'm not gonna reach first place, but I think I have a shot at getting this guy that's in second. Just gonna keep on gaining time on him. Here we go. In two seconds. Let's do it. Might be able to catch up to first place. We do well enough. We'll probably do it. Here we go. Okay, the car was trying to spin out of me, but controlled it. And look at how dirty this buggy is. It's awesome. This guy's name is Slim Sharks. Oh boy. I didn't want to do that. Oh. Okay, so here's what you don't want to do with the buggy is take those jumps at like slanted like that because then you'll lose control oh boy almost lost it right there but I'm okay ah get it under back control got like a fire extinguisher in the back too <laughs> all right we're all good avoid this water if possible can't really somebody's tipped over right there you see that somebody tipped over <laughs> that's amazing all right here we go Woo! I notice the AI slows down a bit when uh, they go through jumps, so that's good for us. Oh, can we get first place? Can't keep up with me. Let's go for first place. When I'm on the turns. Here we go. As long as we, just, as we defend our spot, we should be good to go. Okay, I was about to say, it's... Is he gonna tell me that I missed that checkpoint? That would've been bad, all right. First place. I knew I could do it. I guess I do have a good upgrade set. Yeah, see, in pro, they're all not too far behind each other. 20 points for that championship. That was a good race. It was pretty good. 9,000 credits, barely anything. 7,000 XP, we're almost leveled up again. That's something I noticed. It doesn't really get much harder to level up in this game. It's going to take us maybe a couple episodes to try to get 10 million fans so we can get that next showcase. I would just rather drive my uh, Ford RS 200 or whatever it's called than this thing. Because the Ford RS is way quicker. Obviously this is better for off-road though. Whoa. See, it just tips. <laughs> we're going to check out a beauty spot and we got an XP board up here. Might as well grab it. I wonder if we'll level up from this because we're really close. Ugh. Smash through everything. That is one steep hill. Holy cow. That's extremely steep. 
feel like I've never been on this road. I've only been on this road once because there's a huge dam right there. Let's check this area out. It's a reservoir. Whoa. Marunda Dam. Beautiful, isn't it? Appreciate it from a distance, yeah, but don't go swimming. We gotta drink that. <laughs> so it's like a drinking water thing? That's weird. <laughs> That's pretty cool. You've leveled up, spin for a pri- No, I don't want to do it again! Uh... Alright, let's switch out to our Lamborghini, because it's a really fast car. Let's do it. You I love that thing. Alright. That was fun, though. Oh, yeah, we have two barn finds to go through, by the way. Uh, okay, we got got five so far. Ooh, she's got a giant spoiler on it. So, I did a bit of background on this one. Turns out the guy imported it to modify for the Australian touring car circuit. Never finished it, but at least he saved it from a life of going round in circles all day on a NASCAR track. Look at that spoiler. It's a Hemi, too. That looks like fun. What rank is it? I want to check out that uh, Jaguar too, although it's super slow. Holden Mustang. Hmm. It's got a good acceleration apparently. Let's check out this other car. It's a Maserati apparently. The Pininfarina Berlinetta. Ooh. They made four of these. Four. That's it. And now we're standing in front of one. I'm telling you, this feeling is what I live for. Wow. What a beauty. What about the rank? Oh yeah, it's down there. <laughs> um, should we take out the, the Hemi for a spin? Let's do it. I don't know if I should upgrade this thing. Probably should. Alright. Let's keep it a blue because we found it that way. Upgrade its brakes and all that other good stuff. Make it race ready. Could make it lower too if we wanted to. It's pretty high up though. Turn it into an off-road car. Wow. That's a major brake upgrade. Look at how much uh, the transmission improves the speed. It's by a lot. We could put some giant, giant back wheels on this and improve launch. Maybe even turn it into like a dragster car. <laughs> um, let's see what we can do here. I don't think that's worth it. What about this spoiler? This giant spoiler in the back. Oh, you can just completely get rid of it. Improve speed quite a bit. I don't know if it's worth it though. Let's see what else we can do. Um, we might we might as well bring it up all the way up to the the best C class can go. Acceleration, speed, yeah, sure, why not? We'll get some air intake. Just to improve everything. And why not the flywheel? Usually it doesn't increase points too much. And then sometimes this it doesn't really put up your points. Worse for speed and acceleration. Eh. More engine power though, and efficiency, so I don't know. It's five ninety nine, I don't know if we can get it to six hundred anymore. Oh yes we can. Let's do it. Alright. Let's check out how this thing drives. It's a little bit better than the original, but that's okay. It's all racing gear too. Alright, we got a wheel spin, let's do it. I like the sound of the engine though. It sounds really nice. Alright. What kind of engine does this thing have? 100,000! Oh! Oh my god! 100,000! Woo! That's always awesome. Let's see if we can get a Horizon. Aww. We are. Eh. 7,000 credits. Meh. Yeah. Oh well, it's credits. It's free. It's about as much as a race gives us, anyway. 30,000 ain't bad. We got more of them? Holy cow! Holy smokes, how many wheel spins do we have? I don't even know how many we have. Quite a few, apparently. I mean, 15,000 is a bad one. Another one? What? A G2 Horizon Edition would be awesome. <gasps> no way! No! We got another one! We got a 4 GT Horizon Edition. You know how much those things are worth? You get bonuses for them. Ultimobile? That thing looks pretty cool. Okay, that's all. Alright, we'll take this thing for a spin. Wow, I like it. It's got massive back tires and like really thin front tires. <laughs> Definitely some bad handling though. Oh boy, this thing doesn't like off-road. That's understandable though. Wow. Ooh, look at this interior. 
I like it. I noticed back then the steering wheels were like really large but really thin on the spoke. Or like the... It can sway pretty well. Look at that. Woo! Woo! I like it. It's a nice car. Pretty ugly though. At least in my opinion. I like the back of it though. Dodge Chargers are pretty cool. I don't know about the front though. Ugh, looks like a bow. <laughs> I like I like some muscle and I don't like some of it. I don't know. I want to check out that new Horizon GT. We do we do have a regular Ford GT. You know the new Ford GT. Holy cow! This thing does not want to stop. <laughs> All right, let's test out the braking on this thing. So let's get up to like. 100 miles per hour and slam on the brakes. Go ahead and do that real quick. All right, we're gonna slam on the brakes now. The braking could be better. Look at the look at the trail we just left. There's like da -da 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 -da. <laughs> engine sounds amazing though. Listen to that engine. It's a Hemi. Woo. I never checked out the engine of this thing like in the car view. I should spend more time in the car viewer. So we're gonna head back to the festival and check out that Ford GT that's Horizon Edition. Hopefully it's pretty good. We got a credits boost. I didn't really like the Dodge Viper. I don't know, it's just, just handling though, ugh. I think it's on the other side, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's definitely on the other side. So we have to take this path. Oh, well that's a way to stop. <laughs> this thing cannot off-road by the way at all. Better than some cars though. Suspension is pretty good. It's nice and high up, so it can take some bumps. There we go. Let's check out that Horizon Edition. Okay, the Horizon Edition isn't worth anything more than the regular one, but you do get credit boosts, and it's got s hopefully some good stats and good upgrades to it. I would guess it would, but let's go ahead and take it for a spin. Look at this beauty. It's just the stealthy black with carbon fiber. Oh, man. Let's see if we can open it up. Ah, uh, we can't make it explode. Darn. Go ahead and open this door. The whole bottom part is the door? What? That's cool. That's a big door then. It's, it's a V6 EcoBoost, by the way. One of my friends, we were like kind of arguing about it and like, we we're like, oh, it's not an EcoBoost. It's like, it's like this and that. Ooh, wow. You can customize your whole car through here too. Can we turn it on? What? We can turn it on? Oh, that's just so we can drive it. Oh, look at those backlights. I love the I love the design on this thing. Oh, you can rev it in the garage? I didn't know you could do such a thing. That's cool. We're like so far in the series and I just now discovered that. Listen to that. The whole, the whole thing works too. Wow. Alright. Go ahead and take it for a spin. Oh, it's got the white stripes on it too. Sweet. It's definitely a lot better than the other one that I upgraded. Oh boy, rough launch. It acts a lot like the Dodge Chart or the Dodge Viper, where the launch is just so like it's not good. All right. This didn't even have upgraded brakes. I like the spoiler on it. The spoiler looks nice. Man, this thing does not want to stay stable in the first three gears. I don't know if I like that. This thing can apparently go really fast, though. Uh, the speed was 10 on it, so I'm guessing it can at least hit, like... Oh, it can, it's probably going to hit 250, no problem. Oh, boy. <laughs> Let's see how fast we can get this thing. We probably should take it to the highway, but that's okay. I mean, we got a turn coming up, but should be able to max it out. I'm guessing 250, probably something like that. Oh boy, we're going to go on the air. Don't tell me it's going to be 260. <laughs> okay, we're going to rewind and then we'll see if we can reach 260. Holy cow. 260, baby. Come on. We need to take this in on the highway. It could definitely hit 260, though. Maybe even 270. Let's slow down. This thing's got an exceptional braking. Look at that. Started breaking all the way back there. Like, that's really good for going so fast. Let's go ahead and find a barn find since we're about to end the episode anyway. 
Uh, one tip I learned about barn finds, which I'll probably do a video about this, is uh, if you look on the map, you can actually see where like the buildings are and stuff like that. I'm guessing it's going to be somewhere over here or up there. So let's go ahead and check out this spot over here. Could possibly be that shack over there. Let's check it out. Nah, I don't think it is. It can't be. Medium bucket list. Yeah, that's not it. Let's keep on looking around. It can't be in the middle of the plantation farm. That would be bad. All right. Could be this over here. Let's go ahead and check out this farm before we head over there. Don't try to off-road this vehicle, by the way. It doesn't work that well. Okay, that's not it. What about this? Nope. All right. All righty. So let's take it out here, then. Woo! Ooh, that would have been bad. Look at that. I have damage turned off. I mean, even the cosmetic damage kind of annoyed me. The seven-year car, like, all banged up. Where is this thing? Oh, we got a, got a travel thing over here. Can we hit this? Bing bong. We can fit our car in there. Holy cow. We need a smaller car. <laughs> oh, boy. A way smaller car. Unless we can, like, shove something in there. I've checked all the buildings on this map, and I'm not exactly sure where it's at. I checked this area, this area over here, and also this area. Which I want to get that, um, that little sign there so we can get faster, or cheaper fast travel, but I can't really get it from here. They have, like, a way smaller car. Um, there's also an XP boost somewhere, and a couple of them where uh, they were on the top of, like, a building. You have to, like, take off a ramp with, like, a pretty fast car and then get it that way. I have no idea what this barn find is. It, can't, it would it would suck if it was in, like, inside of here. I'm pretty sure it's not, though. It can't be. There's another barn find over there. I'm just going to keep on looking. Destroy all these. I'm not even sure what kind of things are these. Are they, like, are they bananas or what? I don't even know. Got a nice, dirty Ford GT now. I wonder if this is it right here. Oh, maybe not. Oh, where is this thing? I don't know. I don't know anymore. <laughs> is this the building? Apparently not. Oh, why do these, why all these buildings look the same? I wonder if this is it. Come on, this has to be it. Please tell me this is it. This is right on the outskirts of it too. That's weird. Still not it. These are the farm buildings. What is that building over there? Is that to the other one? Probably is. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Oh, I think I saw it over there. Pretty sure that's it. I don't know if that over there. Actually, the... I think, I think that looks like it. That's right on the main path, though. That doesn't make any sense. That probably isn't it. I don't know. It's turning night really fast. Oh, that has to be it. It's hidden away. There we go. We got it. Awesome. Let's see what we got. Would you like to do the honors? What is that? It's a Lamborghini, apparently. That is a Lamborghini, believe it or not. What? The LM002 was supposed to be a luxury car you could take off-road. Looks like this one's been hitting the dirt too hard. The suspension's gone. Oh, that would be sweet to drive a vehicle like that. Never knew a Lamborghini made an off-road vehicle. Well, besides the SUV, that's not really an off-road specific car. I'll take this back Isn't to the that shop. awesome? Replace the springs, clean it up. Won't take long. Wow. All right, so, well, that will conclude the episode, guys. See you later. Let me know if you guys want me to do more bard finds. I'll try to fit one in every once in a while. I don't want to complete them until, like, towards the end of the series, though. So, um, we still got one, two, three, four, and I think more might pop up. Five, six, seven barn finds. So, yeah, probably could do one next episode, too. I don't know. Just depends on how much time we have. But peace. See you later.